Hey y'all, Coach in the Fight here. Got Shadow Man with me. You can tell he's a little beat up here. Um, actually, it's the camera that's beat up. But I wanted to come on here today, um, better late than never, and tell you guys that the Sabbath day starts on Tuesday. Um, we had the new moon sighted on the 18th of July, uh, which was a Tuesday evening. So the Sabbath days for the next quarter will be uh, from Tuesday evening to Wednesday evening. Um, and like I said, I just wanted to come on here despite everything and tell you guys um, um, that um, it is very late and I do apologize. Um, um, I don't know what all I can tell you guys. I want to tell you guys what I'm going through because, you know, it doesn't seem all personal. Some of this seems like it could be um, affecting more than just me. And so I think, you know, I should share um, with share some of this stuff with you guys, some of the things that I'm going through, some of the things that my family is going through. But really, I just don't know. I don't know how. I mean, this is a public platform. Hundreds of people will get to see and hear whatever it is that I say. So I have to be real careful. Um, but um, also, all I'll just say is, guys, please, please, please pray for me. Pray for my family, especially. I am holding strong. Uh, personally, I mean, I am a warrior. I, I told you guys I'm built for this, but my family, they, they, they are not. They're not. They're not as, um, let me just say, diligent as I am when it comes to this walk and to this fight. And we're taking casualties. Um, we're taking casualties here at the homestead. Um, the strong are holding strong, but the weak are getting weaker. If you know what I mean. So. Y'all continue to uh, pray, pray for me. Um, but while we're talking about the Sabbath day, I'm sorry, I can't get the camera right. The phone is really, really messed up. Um, a little bit of sabotage, I believe, involved. But anyway, um, I, I, one of the things that I learned over the course of this um, um, vacation time that I've been on for the last month is the importance of the Sabbath day. And it is truly a necessary rest day for our bodies. I wanted to share you guys, share with you guys um, something that I learned about the Sabbath day and how not adhering to the Sabbath day will actually lead to our destruction. Um, it boils down to our body and our rest and not having a chance to recover if we don't, you know, mind the Sabbath day. If we don't take advantage of the Sabbath day. We're not giving our bodies the chance to rest and we're not giving our spirits the chance to rest and to communicate with our father. And so and therefore it's leaving us in a weakened state. Um, this, as you know, last month and even this month, there is um, some hiccups in our sacred calendar because of how it works. You know, the 364 days has always caused confusion. Well, here we're learning the importance of the 364th day in the year 2023. And it's causing a lot of um, 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 turbulence, as I would say. And last month um, was a lot of this turbulence. Um, and we wasn't able to adhere to the Sabbath day like we normally do. Let me move out of the way of this truck. And by doing so, what, what ended up happening, I'll tell you personally what ended up happening for me. Um, because of the debacle, I ended up taking two half a day Sabbath days instead of a whole complete full rest day. And I think I paid for it over the course of that month. Um, we were traveling and, and at people houses and we couldn't really keep the Sabbath day like we normally would. Um, there was a lot of television involved and, you know, a lot of things that you wouldn't normally do on a Sabbath day. Um, I believe prevented me personally from getting the rest I needed. And as a result, I saw my body start to deteriorate in the form of a toothache um, infection and my tooth started to build up. And I got a toothache, something I haven't experienced in a number of years. And I attributed it to not having enough rest. There was some stuff going on elsewhere in my body, just feeling tired in my legs and different stuff like that. And I believe it was because of the rest and not keeping the Sabbath day correctly. And my point is, is if I had continued um, as hard as I work, you know, as if I'd have continued not getting the proper rest, I believe, you know, things by now would be way, way worse. So 
praise our Father in heaven um, where we are able to get back on track. He doesn't hold things against us. You know, it's, 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 it's the Sabbath is about us, not us for the Sabbath. The Sabbath is for my body to rest, you know, so I'm not hurting the Sabbath day um, by not keeping it. But by keeping it, I am helping my body. That's what he means by the Sabbath day is for me, not me for the Sabbath. So I'm able to get back on track, able to keep the Sabbath day and then able to build my body strength back up and able to stay in the fight. So just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, again, the Sabbath days are Tuesday evening um, till Wednesday. So that's from, we go from 6 p.m. or um, standard time, 6 p.m. standard time is how we do it, 6 to 6. Um, and that really came in handy up in the mountains where, you know, there's the sun, it doesn't get dark for a very long time. It gets dark almost like 9.30 or something like that. And so it throws your, your day off a little bit. But when you go from six to six, it, it all stays in line. So you get a complete 24 hours no matter you know when it gets dark or when the sun goes down. So that's what we'll do today, um, starting at 6 p.m. And that is standard time. While most of our clocks is set to daylight savings time, so there will be an hour ahead displaying at 7 o'clock instead of 6 o'clock. But either way, at 6 p.m. standard time, we will um, have all of our food cooked, all of our house cleaned, all of our um, uh, stuff prepared, all of our water ran and everything we want to do as we get ready for tomorrow where we'll do a lot of reading, a lot of praying and a whole lot of nothing as we try to get our rest and then get ready to start another week. So if you guys want to partake in all of the Sabbath day activities, um, we can do so. Um, all together if we want to talk about it we could do so down in the comment section and you know what I'll see you down there Salamama